good morning so in artificial intelligence and soft computing in a previous lecture we have seen a general introduction regarding to informed search strategy and what is a heuristic or what is a heuristic function and how a heuristic value will be calculated so in this lecture we'll see the first informed search strategy that is nothing but a hill climbing algorithm and how this particular hill climbing algorithm works So, a hill climbing algorithm is one of the informed search strategy. So, as we have seen regarding to informed search strategy, so this informed search strategy is providing a three type of information. Okay, that is nothing but what is the initial state, what is a goal state. and what is some sort of hint information which is associated with each of the particular node suppose this is a tree provided to us so in this tree we have a which is nothing but the initial state we have k which is nothing but the goal state and these are the hint informations which are provided to us so this particular value which is called as heuristic value which helps to compare in between the paths available so why this information is important in a previous uninformed search strategy we are following these paths randomly or we can say a blankly or a blindly we are not aware of which path is best okay and which path is worst but we are following that path randomly and if we got a success randomly then it's okay if we are not getting a success randomly then we have to follow or we have to remain following a different path or exploring a different path in this a hill climbing algorithm or in this type of informed search strategy we have this information which helps us to compare between the states so we have these particular heuristic value four six five so how this hill climbing algorithm will be conducted will first visit this particular node a if this particular node is a goal node then it's okay print succeed and stop there if this is not a goal node then close it and check whether it is having successors it is now having a successors b c and d these successors are nothing but a different path available to conduct a searching process but in a previous searching strategy we are conducting it randomly or we are exploring it randomly but here we are not going to explore it randomly we are going to compare in between these particular states so we will check what is the heuristic value of this is nothing but a 4 what is heuristic value of this is nothing but a 6 so this is 5 so we'll check this if this is not a goal node then we'll explore its these particular successors and will put or will push a node with the least success rate or we can say unpromising at the bottom of our stack as this is a uh, we are using here a stack data structure so this is having a worse success rate so we'll push it uh, put it at the bottom we'll open it first then we'll open d and then we'll open c and we'll push them into a, a stack so a particular node which is having a maximum success rate will come at the top of our stack and will cross check that particular node so we'll see in our algorithm we are opening this particular we are using a two queues as per our uninformed search strategy okay we are using here two stacks one is closed stack one is open stack one variable which is initialized or equalized to our goal state we'll compare a if it is not a goal node then go to explore its successors so i'm going to close a and i'm going to open its successors and how i'm opening them is nothing but a particular successor which is having a worse success rate i'm putting at the bottom then next and then next at the top i'll, uh, I'll uh, uh, put a node which is having a maximum success rate so now i'll compare this c okay so i'll compare c along with the goal state it is not a goal node so as this is not a goal node i am going to explore 
its successors so i am having its successors g and h so now i am having a h which is having a maximum success rate and g is having a least success rate so i'll open this g first and then i'll open h so my topmost element under my stack is nothing but a h which is nothing but having a heuristic value 8 okay while writing my all the nodes in open stack i should also put a heuristic value associated with that particular node as like i am putting here so now h is newly or which is on the topmost element under my stack so i'll cross check it across my goal node if it is a goal node print succeed and stop there if it is not a goal node i should check whether that particular node is having its successor as yes, h is having a successor so i'll check whether it is having a single successor or it is having a multiple successor if it is having a multiple successor i have to sort them according to the heuristic function so that the particular node which is having a least success rate will, uh, will be visited first and will be pushed into a stack first and then a particular node which is having a maximum success rate will be pushed into a stack so that it can come at the top of our stack and we can visit it first or we can check it first so now a k node will be pushed into a stack as this is a single node okay so k i'll compare along with the goal node so k I'm, as i'm comparing along with the goal node it is a goal node provided so i'm achieving a goal node so i'll stop there k okay, and print a success message because my uh, in uh, that hill climbing algorithm or hill climbing search is over Okay, so in this way, we are conducting a first type of inform search strategy that is nothing but a hill climbing algorithm. A steps in a hill climbing algorithm. So step number one in a hill climbing algorithm, create a single member stack comparison of a root node that is open stack. Step number two, if a first member is a goal node, go to step five. Step number three, if first member is not a goal node, then remove it and add it to the list of visited nodes open its successors if any sort them according to the heuristic function and add them to the open stack follow same process till goal node is achieved or go to step number six step four is nothing but if q is empty go to step number six else go to step number two step number five print success and stop there step number six print fell and stop so these are all the steps in hill climbing algorithm so we'll stop here along with this first inform search strategy that is nothing but a hill climbing algorithm go through this video and if you like this please click on a like button and subscribe my channel thank you